Hello everyone, and welcome back to more Let's Play Resident Evil Revelations Raid Mode. Got through that pretty well. I'm the Black Shadow, um, accompanied by uh, yours truly as well. Hi everybody, it's uh, me again. Once again, as uh, we are just coming through the back stages now of uh, Abyss Mode. We've uh, only got ten stages to go, everyone. Woo! Woo! What was that? It's like someone I'm scared, opened. It's like someone opened. It's like someone opened a door. A I'm creep. scared. Scared. I'm... Nothing to be scared about. It's abyss mode. I'm being realistic here, boss. You're, you're being realistic. Have have faith. Have faith. Anyways, folks. Yes. Yeah, so we've got uh, ten more stages left to do. Um, and the last couple of videos have gone all right, seeing as I have started bringing out the somewhat bigger guns, i.e., the guns that I'd set the, the guns I refused to sell when I started this raid mode stuff because it was worth too much. Speaking of guns that were worth way too much, is this gun here, the Samurai Edge, uh, which I have leveled to absolute bajillions. Uh, and and, uh, well, I figured, you know, we only got ten more stages to go, and, you know, I've already brought out the sledgehammer, which I've since upped its firepower a little bit, so I figure, eh, I'll show off the Samurai Edge as well, I mean, you know, it's a cool gun, it's got a, a firing speed that's kind of frightening, and, you know, when Jill uses this, she reloads it in the blink of an eye, literally. Uh, so I thought, you know, I'm gonna bring this out and show off, as you can see, it's worth a lot of money was never selling this. Who do you think you are? Uh, also bring the peanut along because uh, we're running through this one as Chris, who of course doesn't have a machine gun speciality. I could have given him a sniper actually thinking about it. Nah. 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 Too bad giving him a punching ability is not an option because he could punch the snot out of some things. Well, I can still give him physical damage plus 50%, which is kind of equivalent to a neutron bomb. Do I really want piercing on the P90? I think uh, so. I, I think that would perhaps be a, a good idea, especially with the fire rate this can be packing, so, uh, should be good. Good times to be had. And Keith's come along because that makes logical sense. You gotta mix it up sometimes. Plus, I wanted that melee damage. Oh, yeah. Oh, I do like his melee attack. It would have been very useful in the build, but we did alright. Make sure you get my back. Let's have some fun out there. I'll get your front, too. <laughs> Lol. So, I, I tried not to, but I did. I know you I tried. You you did your best, but you just, 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 it was, it was, it was always meant to be. Here we go, Chris Bunch! Yeah, uppercut! Because I know you guys have missed that. Just like us. Wow! Chris has actually not got a bad reload on this gun for not having any speciality or improvements at all this way. I think his speciality is being a badass. Kind of Resident Evil in a nutshell, perhaps? Well, that's, yeah, that's the theme. Alright, inwards we go then. So I'm sure you guys remember how the semi ramis works. We need to uh, mosey our way down to the casino area. And murder about six million enemies in the meantime. Fortunately, they don't fancy being murdered today. They're going to be kind of resistant. But yeah, here's the, uh, the Samurai Edge. It's, it's... You know, it's the old 92FS custom, you know, that we've all gotten accustomed to now. <laughs> Get it accustomed! Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, I am on fire today. We just can't help ourselves today. We are on fire. Right. Just as a warning, it's going to get pretty chaotic in here. Just a warning. But, uh, you know, standard... Uh, Standard promenade, promenade deck rules apply, as in, don't be here. Ooh, yes. It's like it's like a it's like Chris just bullying a kid. I mean, he just basically he just punched a baby. 
I would put it that strongly, but... Oh, there are absolutely no supplies in this room, that's a bit. Oh, I forgot there were hunters in here. Okay, I had a bunch of little people trying to kill me, and then... You mean like th those oh, little yeah, people? Oh, yeah, there Found him. Booyaka shot! <gasps> Upgraded sledgehammer! Suckers! You had no chance. Oh, mini hunters! They're so cute! Not. You just. I'm pretty sure you just killed them. Both I just the punched way. them both into oblivion. Good times. Here comes Cactus! Oh. I don't know where they are. Oh, there he is! Run for your life! I wish I had a sprint button. Because I would be pushing it. Oh, there's two of them. In, oh. in here, into the room. Into the room. We, we're going to need to funnel these guys as best as we can. Why even get a nap on them? I, I'm thinking trying to get a cheeky melee hit on them. I don't think it's a good idea. We just need to stay pretty mobile. It's best thing. We need to kind of lead them on a merry dance while we slowly pick away at them. Mm. Oh, I'll take a melee hit if I can get. Oh, the, the, the skag dead's come down for you, has it? It hasn't for me! Murder most foul! No, stay away from me! Look how like, lanky I am. There's nothing delicious on my body that you should have. Oh, shit, the other one. Well, it was there. It just did disappearing at. Oh, dear. They're, now they're teleporting. Ladies and gentlemen, my plan has kind of fallen apart courtesy of. Connection reasons. Oh shoot. Oh shit! That's a bad spot. <laughs> These gagnets are there. I don't know, but I don't like them. One is too many. Oh, you hunters up there as well? Wow! What a full bloody compliment today. Those. Ooh, dear. Gone, monster. Uh. This one appears to be stuck in some sort of time loop, so I will take you back. I would. You're sh uh. Uh. I think the one you're shooting is oh, not. Oh shit! Oh, this is a bad spot. Hello, everyone. Nice to see you. Right, Skydeads are down. Ow! Not too soon. How can you hit me for so much damage, you jerk? You're only little! You're like a junior! There we go. Big things come in small packages. I hear more of them. That's oh, speaking oh, of big know. things in little packages, oh dear. Someone got a little bit ahead of themselves. Oh dear, we don't want to be here. Jump down. <laughs> like I said. No, 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 no. Don't be there. Be somewhere else. <laughs> I know you got away with that. Take it really? and run. Oh shit. I think I owe my firstborn child to somebody. That, uh, run. Run, run, run upstairs. Run up now. Mother. Well, we got away with that one, I think. Although, uh, I'm not exactly out of the woods yet. I'm so glad I bought the sledgehammer with Chris with Shotgun Mastery. The best decision I've made all day. Whale on these suckers. Not okay, getting much uh, critical hit chaining on these skag dead. Oh, no. what, is, what is going on back there? The problem is, we, we can't just run in a way. I mean, as much as we obviously need to be very careful, we've still got to leave them and keep them in a, in a tight pack. You're saying that, but the things you're shooting are not where... Are not where they are. Yeah, this is the problem. So, the 
principle's sort of semi-correct, but if we sort of stay together, they'll kind of hopefully sink back together somewhat. At least yeah, that's the Even if I shoot at the area you're shooting, it doesn't do anything. Oh, no, no. Wow, this shotgun proving indispensable. Oh, man. Sledgehammer City. have one left, right? Yep. Who's in two completely different areas of time and space, but, uh, oh well. Yeah, that's that's pretty good going, that. I think we... It, it can work out sometimes in a very glitchy, you don't want to depend on it kind of way, because on my screen, he's so concentrated on you that he doesn't notice me, but at the same time, you never know when they're going to switch. Oh no, and, you, like, you never know. Always, it can be pretty unpredictable. Also, I have no shotgun rounds anymore. Yay! So, uh, gonna have to kind of uh, wangle my way through pretty much the rest of this now, because I could have done with those shotgun shells kind of later on. Never mind. That is abyss summed up quite nicely. I've learned. Yep. Oh, hello. Go about you. Whoa, 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 dude. Yeah, I'll have to leave the shotgun into you. I shot you in the butt. I shot you in the butt. I'm trying to. I'm trying to shoot you in your little head. Whoa, back off. Nope, nope, nope. Must admit, handguns have proved more effective some days. Oh, hello. I can dig that. As long as you very swiftly move away from him, he will try and eat you. Getting throwing some... another one, I'm throwing another one. Yeah. No, not the greatest timing, but it did the trick. Lovely. Shotgun shells! Thank goodness. I'm up to 30. Hooray for that. You know, Resident Evil makes me twice as nervous when they give you what you need. <laughs> you like, I've learned that's terrible. Terrible. Yeah. You want Mac? Oh, sh oh dear! Forgot about you guys. Oh no! Be careful of uh, the special one. He will very easily grab you and immediately kill you. Don't let him get anywhere near. Keep your distance. Oh, I shot him in his leg. He's named even. He is as well as uh, Johnny Nitro, I think that might. Oh no, maybe not. He's moving too much. Nish. Jay Nishino, not Johnny Nitro. Johnny Nitro is a Point, point for naming that reference, everyone. That's a pretty good reference. I've given out far hard on this channel, so. I bet you guys completely own that. But this whole shooting him and getting him on the ground was a brilliant plan, even if it wasn't intended. As I say, the amount of times he's just grabbed me in this little kill, he does so much damage, especially there, he's boosted to level 46. He grabs you, you die. So, uh, be careful of that. Well, I tell you what, for the first part of Semiramis, we've, we've done all right. Considering right. all of those, Skag dead. Yeah. Yeah. Skag decks give me. I don't like the way they make me feel emotional. 
that. Right, now there are some bits and pieces for us to grab here. There is a green, there it is. There's always a green herb lying around in this room. There always is. And I believe as well, if you come upstairs... Is it like down the back? I think there's like, uh, yeah, there's a couple of boxes of ammo over here. And I think there's uh, an emblem down here you can grab as well. Yeah, it's only a, only a bronze, but, you know... Heads up. Better than a kick in the teeth. <laughs> Rightio. Maximum health. Very good. Means I can be pretty liberal in my green herb usage here. And green harps. That. I don't even remember which playthrough that was in. Uh, Resident Evil 2, Resident Evil 3, uh, both the mercenaries for those games. Arms. Interesting translation error, which I, I'm, I'm amazed how they didn't A, pick it up in the first game, and then B, managed to realise it would happen in the next Mercenaries of RE3, and they still let it through. Having already corrected it in the campaign. Twice. <laughs> right. I must admit, I do not remember what is in here. Um, well, considering the shaking door, I can only imagine. Oh, yeah, there is that, but I mean, there's stuff to do first. Fish, probably. Good guess! Got grenades! Oh, I forgot they've got these rock guys oh, as well. That's. Insane. Yeah, I forgot there's loads of these rock guys in here, so be careful with that. I'm trying to just deal with some of these fish first. It's not helping that they're flickering around the screen. Right. Have some fun here. But yeah, try and deal with the fish first if you can. I know it's asking a lot. I wouldn't bother trying to shotgun them. The, you, you, you do well to shotgun them. Those rock guys are surprisingly dangerous. And fuck, what just happened there? That was kind of frightening. Uh, everything's so quick. Uh, I'm just trying to shot grenade these things. They're so fast, I can barely shoot them. This game absurd. These fish. Fish are really, really interesting. Uh, flash grenade is not going to do anything. very much. No. Oh dear. Folks, I have a situation you here. Are in... okay. Oh, thank you. Do me a favor. Uh -huh. Distracted him. And that looked like a great <laughs> critical shot, that. Stupid fish. This is why I don't need to see food. Right, because of Resident Evil Revelation. Let's not forget about the, uh, the several years beforehand where you may not have even seen food before this game existed. Well, this is only reinforced the fact. Oh, what a dodge! I didn't even mean it! Stab! Uh, grenades can do against the rocks. Mm -hmm. oh, that reload speed's just too slow. This fish, listen, dude. You don't back off. I don't know what I'm gonna do, because I clearly can't hit you. But I'm gonna do shit, it, and shit, I have to do it out. Shit, 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 shit. Sir, we can reconsider, surely. Uh. Watch out, big fish. Right, we need to not be here. Get some space. The fish are a lot faster than the rock guys until they charge us and then they're like bloody Ridley Jacobs on speed. Oh, I know it's behind me as well, but I just don't want to look. 
I hit it when I'm right. Why don't you do something else? That's something constructive to do with your life. Fucking fish. It's nice though with the, a good handgun. Like once you can shoot them, it kind of stuns them. Oh yeah! If you, once you, it's that once you start shooting them, it's fine. <laughs> What's that? Oh, oh right. hat. Little stick. Oh, what a shot that was, folks. That'll look good. Picked him out of mid-air. Right, I'm going back up the stairs. It's the only half-safe place I've got to try and funnel the fish. There's so many of them! Yeah, I feel like as soon as we can get these fish sorted out, we can really... Oh, yeah, exactly. It's the fish that It's you! You're a fish! I would be such a more beautiful fish than this if I were a fish. Oh dear. And I'm just as annoying as a fish if I am a person. Oh, I'd rather not be there anymore. Got some custom parts from killing you, I think. I hope they're good. I bet they're pink. Okay. Having no shotgun ammo, any having no machine gun ammo is a bit of a problem here. Can't really use the shotgun either, because I need them. I'm going to need those for the, uh, for the rock guy, so thank you. I don't have any machine gun ammo. Oh, dear. Well, I think the fish are largely gone now. No, there's one more left. Of Hence the words large. Oh dear, don't want to be here anymore. Let us vacate the I area. I don't even want to be in this casino. I know, it's terrible. This is why gambling's bad for you. Oh no, let's, 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 let's not go down this, this route now. Have an idea. Yeah. Decoys might be of some use here. Wow, I did some damage. What a dodge. Yeah, I'll take it, folks. If he's going to stand there like um, General Dipshit. Ow. Shit. Watch out for the guy going upstairs. Die. No, it's not that hard. Oh, yes, thank you. Just have to submit to uh, all of our ammo. Pretty much literally all of it at the rate this is going. Well, ammo is starting to be a slight concern. I mean, I've got plenty of handgun, but that's it. Forget how effective handguns are going to be against this guy. Because we're I kind of need to keep hold of the shotgun shells. I'm going to kind of need those. Oh, good. Handguns are all right. Where is this fool? Right, now what we need him to do is... Yeah, there we go. You can get this guy to walk around clockwise. He opens himself up to a sack. And he's nice, easy picking. So, uh... Mm -hmm. That's the trick here, folks. Make him go clockwise. No, clockwise. Yeah, that'll do. Rocking around. Clock. Casino. Clock. I don't know. It sounded like a Christmas song, maybe. I it, it, you sort of started going down that route and you kind of just lost your way. And yeah. It sounds like life. Right. The escape route is open. <laughs> However! <laughs> Why would we want to do that? I did. I didn't. Oh, I forgot the skank dead to go for the decoys. To do, huh? Shit. 
This is why I wanted to keep on with some shotgun shells, folks, because it's very useful here. It might even be worth trying to flash grenade this skag dead at the moment. Attack! Yes! <laughs> I almost want to shotgun the uh, the rock dudes first because they're so vulnerable to shotgun shells. Especially to the sledgehammer, they will they will fall pretty quickly. Ugh. Never mind. Oh, what have I done? That was a terrible idea, Shadow. What are you thinking? Must have thought you were living in magic land there. Oh, shit. He's just the one, right? Really nervous. Hardly sure what this skag dead is. Where he, where exactly he thinks he is. For me, he's on the stick. Bollocks. Well, he's trying to murder me. That's that's all I wanted to know. Was he attempting to murder me and what or not? The answer is yes. Oh yeah. Frag grenades so effective against the wrong guys there. You get a nice hit. No, 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 Oh, invincibility frames. Invincibility frames. They were glorious. Oh, that was frightening. Oh, that was close. I am now out of shotgun rounds as well. Just to keep things interesting. Go. Wow, you quickly hit it. Well done. It was super effective. Not sure that's how that guy sounds. I'll take it. Throw that. It is super effective. I don't know what that was. In my head, it just sounds like, ugh. I shall be defended successfully by my blackjack tables. Blackjack! Not good. Phew! Thank goodness for that. And the Akaluzo! I think that's what this guy's actually called. Stab! Fortunately, not as quick as Valentine, of course, but it all, it all counts nonetheless. But yeah, Keith just, just too many things. There you go. And also, there's your little silver one hiding underneath the desk if I could ever actually not get blocked by this thing. We did it! Ooh, I can breathe again. That went pretty well, actually, all things considered. I know we're going to get like C. I think we did all right there. That could have been a lot worse. Yeah, that could have. Basically, it could have ended at any time. Yeah, I, I think the first part we did pretty well, and then we just sort of started running out of ammo a little bit and kind of went away from there. But I think we did all right. I'm pretty, pretty happy with that, everyone. Took a little while, as unfortunately pretty much all these stages are going to do now. They're all going to take a little while. Oh, I can't wait for us to do Zenobia. Oh man, that's going to be a real popcorn fest. <laughs> Sweet Mary and Joseph. Bless our hearts. Bless our silly little hearts. Mm. But nonetheless, folks, that is stage 11 complete. Way. 
Which means we then get to move on to what I would suggest is possibly one of the worst stages in the game. I hate this one with a passion. Not a fan. The amount of times I've gotten annihilated on this on Abyss on my own is pretty, pretty miserable. I've got a terrible record on this level. And we get to tackle it next time, everyone! Because that's going to be fun. Ugh. I hope you're all enjoying the pain well, that if, we're going through. Well, if uh, I hope they are, because I'm not. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bye.